Professor, can you hear me? Who's that? You caught me doing the laundry. All these darn sheets. I've got a request to make of you as an old high school friend. Ah, Campbell, is it? The same. Been a while, hasn't it, Professor? Or should that be Stonehead? Oh, don't bring up that old nickname. Haven't we buried the hatchet by now? Anyway, what can I do you for? Got something to ask you, and I'm really hoping you're going to give me the right answer. You know Snake, right? Well, it's been a long time since I had any contact with him. And come to think of it, he was his same old ornery self. That sharp-eyed little tyke. What, something happened to him? Blind-eyed bully, more like. He's dropped off the radar screen. That's so. He always did like playing hide-and-seek back in the day, but... Uh... Huh? I got the sense he really hated it. Anyway, he's infiltrated a base somewhere to destroy the latest version of Messel Gear. But I've heard nothing from him within the agreed amount of time. What? But then what's your request? Out with it. Let me know what you've got in mind. I'd like you to help me locate Snake. Hey, I thought you were the pro at that sort of stuff. <laughs> this old geezer's a pro at studying apes nowadays. Also, I've decided not to get involved in these sort of things anymore. This particular affair is not necessarily without any relevance to you. The latest version of Messel Gear has an ape-like aspect to it. What the heck are you talking about? A specially trained ape guerrilla force commandeered the latest Messel Gear, and they've holed themselves up in a base somewhere. They're demanding ten billion bananas. If we don't give them what they want in 72 hours, they're talking about firing Messel Gear's lazy cannon. Naturally, there's no way the government will accept such outlandish demands. And that's why Snake went storming in. However, I'd, well, those simian specialists who hang out here with you, I'd like to get their help. Mm-hmm. Hmm. hmm. Uh, I'd like to help you, but there's just one snag. You see, all of them, Spike, Jimmy, Kay, and Yumi, are at summer camp for their whole summer break. And they're getting back next week. Summer camp? This is a national emergency. This is a once-in-a-lifetime educational experience. Sure. Whatever you say. Also, the monkey net is broken and can't be used. I see. We wouldn't even be able to capture them. Look, I'm begging you. Isn't there something else you can do? Jeez, put me on the spot, why don't you? Eureka! I've got it! It might be just the ticket. So, what have you got in mind? Is Snake's battle data still around? Yeah, it's around. But what are you getting at? Get it over here at once! I'm going to upload the data into the latest model monkey helmet. Then I'll do a bit of this and some of that, and voila! Uh, sorry. I'm not really following you. The long and short of it is that we'll take a monkey who's loaded up with Snake's battle data and warp him over to where the action is. Will that work? Of course it will. Fight monkeys with monkeys. Campbell, have some faith in me. Hmm. Okay. I'll get his battle data sent over to you right away. One more thing. You'll need to keep this matter absolutely top secret. Gotcha. This is Snake. Anyone on this codec frequency? If you can hear this, get back to me right away. Okay. I can make out the voice of a monkey. But let me guess. You're an agent who's been warped in here. Okay. Key. 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 <laughs> You're sure brimming with confidence, aren't you? So you've come to find me. Okay. Key. 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 I see. The codex broken. Can't use the wide frequency band, so I haven't been able to contact the colonel. Anyway, my mission is to take out the latest version of Messel Gear. Trouble is, I'm located near the innermost part of the base, and it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to move for some time. Looks like I'll need you to do the moving for me. From here on, let's use this frequency to communicate. 
I think you'll be able to provide a good deal of support here. You should also know that the baddies are some pretty tough cookies. Do your best to go around without having them see you. You'll need to be really good at clinging to walls, crawling along slowly, and other actions. If they find you, do everything to get out of there without engaging them. You with me? <coughs> Hope that's true. Let me teach you how to operate the banana pistol. Tilt the right analog stick back to get into position, then release it to fire. Be sure not to run out of ammo. That's why you'll always want to be looking for item boxes. Item boxes contain banana pistol ammo, but also various kinds of other equipment you'll need. If you come across one, grab it without delay. Not too much strain on the brain to keep that in mind, huh? Okay, now head to the far end. You'll find a huge elevator. Let's get in touch again once you've reached it. Okay.